A wonderful place to observe the cosmos. My father started researching the various celestial bodies and their relationships many years ago. Some of them had even struck the Earth around here. He was always fascinated by meteorites, and he passed this fascination along to me. You know, we used to have just enough money for a measly little telescope, and unfortunately, his dream of having his own observatory failed as well. I think that today he would be very proud that the small garage project he started long ago is being continued in a large research institution. Now the only thing missing is the construction of an observatory. Can you help me realize this dream? Right there, guys. Brito here. Welcome to Construction Simulator. Here we are for another episode. We're going to be building an observatory. We're going to need to fill this place up with soil. So I don't know. Um, do we load it into a loader and dump it in here? Do we load it into a truck and dump it in here? Uh, do we get the bulldozer and push it in? I don't know. I think we're going to need a loader, uh, bulldozer, truck, uh, probably all the above, I guess. Um, I guess if we can get the bulldozer up on the top, load it into a truck and dump it and then push it with the bulldozer, it might work. But let's have a quick look at the job. So backfilling and soil compaction is what we need to do. Slab foundation, uh, ground floor, so some concrete walls and pillars, a lot of crane work again. Upper floor, concrete, crane work as always. The courtyard, um, material delivery, uh, flatten the area. And then we're going to have to gravel delivery, compaction, concreting. Uh, transport to special delivery, special component, which I assume would be part of the observatory itself. Then debriefing, so high scope, 899,000. Um, yeah, let's get started. I'll bring all the machines over here and then um, we'll throw in our timer so us getting the job done. But hopefully you've been enjoying the series so far. As always, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the time lapse. Too fast, too slow, good, not good. You guys let me know. Once this job's done, we might do some real time, um, just normal jobs. Um, yeah, some real time normal jobs we do, you know, garage ad ad addition, single family home, warehouse areas, parking lots. We can just do some of these few things, just normal time and, and try and get some normality back to to the, the series without too much time lapse. But if you guys are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, guys, please do so. Being pretty good, thanks for watching. Enjoy the time lapse and we'll see you again soon.
Finally, we can continue my father's work. Soon we'll share information with research centers all over the world and expand our knowledge of the cosmos and the celestial bodies whirling around up there. And now we can also host lectures and research programs from the university here. I hope this showed the city residents that Gigantic Solutions is a versatile company that is interested in the progress of the entire region. Clearly, this would never have been realized in such a way without the amazing service of your company. Thank you.